Hi friends, in the last videos we covered very clearly how to read the end user provided input data by using input function, next how to read command line arguments, everything we covered very clearly sir. Sir, now the next thing, I want to print some output to the end user. How you can do that? What are various output statements are there? That part we have to discuss right. Okay, output statement. Sir, very simple. If you want to provide any output, any output, the only possibility is print a statement we have to use. Are you getting what is that statement, sir? Print, print a statement we require to use. If you want to print uh, some output to the console for the end user sake, then we have to go for print statement, right? Okay, well. Sir, now multiple forms are there related to this print statement, sir. What is the what is the first one, sir? Okay, form one. Assume that print uh, print uh, statement without any argument. Without uh, without any argument. I don't want to use any argument to the print statement. Yes, happily you can use it, sir. What it will do? It will insert a new line character. Are you what is this? What it's going to insert, sir? New line character. It will insert. What it means? Very, very simple. Have a look once. Print a, print a, Durga I am taking. Print a, Durga, Durga I am taking. Now, just a, print I am taking. Next, a, print a, soft I am taking, sir. Durga like. Sir, if I am not taking this one, this print, print statement, I am not taking in the middle, print, what output we have to get, sir? Simple, Durga and then soft we are going to get without this one but if i am taking this one what is the possible what the output is durga and then sir one blank line will be there blank 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 line and then soft by default we are going to print sir okay one blank line blank line means empty empty line by default will be there print soft that's all so wherever a new line character is required simply you can use print without any argument this type of thing is nothing but first version of print statement have a look once sir observe carefully about this terminology here i'm taking print of durga print of durga and then print of soft i'm taking sir okay i'm not using print without any argument okay let me run this code let me run this code sir py test at py durga soft like like it's going to it's going to provide sir meaningful right okay now i'm taking sir in the middle in the middle just a print empty empty print statement i'm taking sir if i consider empty print statement one blank line will be added in the middle have you look once observe the difference right here one blank line added in the middle but earlier we are not having any blank line so print without argument perfectly acceptable this is the first version sir now let me go for second second version of print statement what the second version is print a string argument right okay print a string string argument very very commonly used sir take a bit special care we covered already print of durga print of soft like uh, happily we can we can use print a durga durga itself is acceptable yes happily durga will be printed to the console same way sir even in this string if you want you can use escape characters also no problem escape characters like backslash n backslash t happily you can use suppose i am taking print of durga durga backslash n software okay durga backslash n software sir now do you know here sir durga will be printed and then new line software will be printed in the next line so in this string argument you can use escape characters also similarly print of okay durga backslash t what is the meaning of backslash t sir tab tab software like i'm taking sir software like so it is acceptable print of durga backslash t software i'm taking this one is perfectly acceptable right now have a look once sir i'm trying to take just i'm trying to i'm trying to take sir durga software like i'm taking assume that sir okay simple 
print it is going to print the durga software to the console yes perfectly itself is valid sir now in the middle if you want we can use backslash n backslash n new line character in the string if you want you can use escape characters also no issue at all have you observed right durga is coming because of backslash n next thing is going to come to the next line sir instead of backslash n backslash t also you can take observe very carefully sir here durga under then backslash t tab tab is coming sir so in this string argument you are allowed to use escape characters also acceptable no problem right next uh, can i perform concatenation can i perform multiplication operation yes why not my requirement at last finally is it a single string or not this is about my requirement right sir observe print of print of durga durga plus uh, software like this i'm taking durga plus software so concatenation if you use plus now do you know the result will become durga software single string that a single string we are trying to print sir acceptable similarly print of print a 10 into durga i'm taking 10 into durga this is called a multiplication operation string repetition operator can you please repeat durga 10 times can you please repeat durga 10 times repeat durga 10 times uh, finally it is the string only that the string we are going to print to the console are you getting right so we can use plus operator we can use star operator we can use escape characters like no problem at all sir finally i want a string argument or not that's what right have a look once here i'm trying to take here durga durga plus uh, software i'm taking durga plus a software perfectly acceptable sir durga software we are going to get perfectly acceptable sir now i'm taking 10 into 10 into sir durga 10 into durga i'm taking sir after 10 into durga means uh, finally it is it is durga 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 like finally it is the it is the result only sir now what is the answer we are going to get it is the 10 times durga 10 times durga is going to come this is nothing but what the string repetition operator okay clear right so we can use a string argument there concatenation possible multiplication possible next backslash and backslash t sir but take very very important special care sir i explained already in the last videos but still i am repeating sir do you know plus operator if you are applying plus operator between strings uh, compulsory both arguments uh, should be string type only if you are using star operator for the string compulsory one argument should be string the other argument should be int value by mistake if you are taking any other immediately error we are going to get clear for all of you right this is the second form of print statement right sir up to this we covered two forms of print statement without argument with a string argument right now the next one print statement with the variable number of arguments any number of arguments you can pass it itself is acceptable sir how you can very very simple sir assume a comma b comma c is equal to 10 comma 20 comma 30 a comma b comma c is equal to 10 comma 20 comma 30 is it valid or not <laughs> valid or not yes we covered already right so 10 will be assigned to the a 20 will be assigned to the b 30 will be assigned to the c perfectly it is the valid now i'm trying to take print of values r print of values r okay sir a comma b comma c how many arguments we are passing to the print statement have you observed right this is the first argument string argument second argument is the int value int value int value like so total multiple four arguments i am passing with comma separation 100% pakka it is the valid this is the biggest speciality of python print statement so no other no other language having this type of feature like java or c or c++ like but here perfectly you can pass any number of arguments no problem at all sir what is the output we are going to get sir this knowledge must be very essential observe that values are values are this is the first argument values are first argument next uh, sir comma second argument 
so while printing first argument and second argument in the middle space will come okay in the middle space okay space 10 and then space 20 and then space 30 so for the print statement if you are passing multiple values while printing in the middle which symbols will be there sir space symbols by default will be there take very special care sir let me execute this code have a look once okay here i'm taking here just a comma b comma c is equal to 10 comma 20 comma 30 print a print a values are print of values are a comma b comma c i'm trying to take sir a comma b comma c i'm trying to take what is the output we are going to get sir observe that values are this is the first argument space second argument space third argument space fourth argument like uh, now the output we are going to get values are sir how many arguments we are passing four arguments we are passing this is uh, so print a statement can take any number of arguments any type of argument no problem at all variable number of arguments right sir now there is one special attribute is there that attribute i have to discuss sir which is called the uh, scp attribute print a statement with the uh, which attributes are scp attribute what is the uh, meaning of scp separator what is the meaning of scp sir separator separator attribute what it means where we can use very simple here a comma b comma c comma d is equal to 10 20 30 40 is there can you please tell how many variables are there four variable four values right now my requirement is i want to print i want to print uh, a comma b comma c comma d can you please tell what is the output we are going to get please confirm what is the answer we are going to get sir so the answer is sir a what is the value 10 10 space space b 20 space 30 space 40 so while printing what is the separator separator is the space separator sir but now my requirement is boss i don't want space i don't want space i want to colon <coughs> i want to colon separator something like uh, 10 colon 20 colon 30 colon 40 i want so while printing multiple arguments of the printed statement if you want to specify your own separator then we have to go for scp attribute scp means what separator but not september or something like don't create your own meaning okay now how you can specify print a a comma b comma c comma d so total how many arguments we pass it four four arguments right while printing these argument which is separator i want uh, colon separator i want uh, sir here yes ap is a colon we are taking either you can take within single quote or within double quotes no problem now what is the answer we are going to get this this is the answer sir everyone can aware if you are not specifying sub sep what is the what is the separator i space the default value for scp attribute is the space if you don't want space then you have to specify scp attributes and so most of the people sir what is the meaning of scp attribute like they are going to ask now it is very clear but remember that sir how many print statements are there only one only one one print statement but the multiple arguments uh, now the separator between these arguments uh, for that scp attribute we are using have a look once now observe carefully sir here i'm taking here a comma b comma c comma d is equal to 10 comma 20 comma 30 comma 40 okay like four variables i'm taking sir print of a comma b comma c comma d sir like if i can take normally a b c d what output we are getting observe that 10 space 20 space 30 space 40 like this we are going to get sir in the middle space is there now my job is i don't want space sir. then comma comma or otherwise let me take another comma comma 
एस इज ईक्वल टू ओके उच्च सिंबल यू वांट ओके कॉलन सिंबल ई वांट नौ अबर्व दट वर्ड आंसर सर टेन कॉलन ट्वेंटी कॉलन थर्टी कॉलन फार्टी दिस इज द पर्पस ऑफ एस सर ई डोंट वांट कॉलन ई वांट ईफन सिंबल नो प्रॉब्लम ओके ईफन 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 टू ईफन सिंबल्स आम टेकिंग सर नौ अबर्व दट टेन ईफन ईफन ट्वेंटी ईफन ईफन थर्टी ईफन ईफन सर हिय You can take anything, sir. So in between this, this symbol acts as the separator. What is the need of a CP attribute? Clear, right? Single print statement, multiple arguments. While printing these arguments, I want to keep my own separator. Then we require to go for a CP attribute. If you feel comfortable, then I will introduce one more attribute, end attribute, sir. That part we will discuss. Up to this, any doubt?